don't know what my hair is doing today. Then again, I don't know what it's doing every other day of every day. But, hello, hello, hello. I will be doing a Holy Grail video. Uh, uh, Holy Grail. Uh. Because those are the best, right? You want to see what I love? Um, so I kind of, oh god, I have to say this. Please ignore my fucking door. Do you hear that noise? It's like moving back and forth from air pressure. I don't know. I don't have AC in my dorm, so we have the windows open and then the door makes noise. Just ignore it, please. I try, but it doesn't work very well. Anyway, I try to kind of put my stuff into categories, but I realized I don't have certain things for certain categories, so we're just gonna kind of go with it. So, starting off, we have, okay, so my holy grail sweater of all time is, OMG, this baby right here. Ew, it's like, feels weird because I didn't dry it. I wish I had done that. Um, anyway, this baby is from American Apparel. I bought this two years ago, year and a half ago. I want to say, wow, it's already been that long. I bought this when I was a junior in high school and I am now a freshman in college. And it's reversible and to like this kind of gray, blacky gray color and this is like a cream. And this thing goes with like absolutely anything. I wear this all the time. It's so comfy and I love the way it looks on me. It goes well with jeans, high-waisted jeans, skirts, shorts, I don't know, whatever you want. I can wear this any time of year, any day. What I also love about it, it's one size. So you know, just kind of flows on you. Looks very cute. Um, next up, also from American Apparel, is my holy grail dress of all time. I literally wear this thing all the time. Like, okay, I think I also bought this one junior year in American Apparel. Wow, junior year was a good year for me. I bought like all my shit that I'm about to show you from junior year that I still wear. Hell yes, Sarah, hell yes. This is a size medium slash large. I have two other um, styles of these dresses from American Apparel and one is like a medium large and it's way longer than this one and then the other one is an extra small small and it's like the same as this. So they kind of run weirdly, I guess. But I wear this um, to school, I wear it out, I wear it when I'm being lazy, when I want to look cute, you can dress it up, dress it down, I wear it as a swimsuit cover up wear it all the time. Definitely worth the $50 and it's so cute. Look at these flowers. Next, okay, I have one more American Apparel. I'm so sorry, you guys, but I love that store. Literally, Holy Grail store is American Apparel. Um, shirt would be this shirt. It's kind of the same style as the sweater and that's why it's my Holy Grail as well because it's cropped and it's baggy and it's so comfy. And wow, don't you just love when your camera cuts out on you? Yeah, me too. It's awesome. Next article of clothing of this video, um, this romper, ooh, it's, it gives off the illusion of a dress, but no, 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 people, shorts, it's a romper, um, the back has, like, little ties, and it's peach, so cute, and I love the little sleeves, oh my gosh, I live in this all the time, wear tights, knee highs, anything else, speaking of knee highs, my next holy grail, don't know why I held up two fingers, but I meant this, are black knee-high socks. OMG, ugh. Knee-highs are bay. Oh my god, I can't believe I just said that. But knee-highs are life. Seriously, they look so good on, mm, girl, they make your legs look poppin'. And, I don't know, they're so cute. I love them. I think they jazz up the outfit. Another sock, um, I'm obsessed, oh by the way those knee highs, I think they're from either H&M or Target, who knows, but you can find them like anywhere, and then these socks, oh my god, I think I'm the only person who still wears these, but they're little lacy socks, ooh, girl section in Target, like little girl section in Target, I get the biggest size and I wear these with heels, converse, basically anything, and because I can, why not, I love them. Holy Grail pants are the ones that I'm wearing. I'll show you these. They um, are skinny jeans. They're high-waisted. Um, black from H&M. Got these junior 
here as well. I love them. Look at them. They're so cute. Don't look at my unshaved legs. It's so cute. Um, Holy Grail cardigan, guys. This is from Urban Outfitters. I believe I also bought this shit junior year. Um, it's just a plain black cardigan. Uh, it has pockets, which reason why it is my holy grail is because it has pockets. Obviously, it's thick, it's black, it's plain, goes with anything. I love it. I'm obsessed. I could wear this all the time. It's so comfy. I could sleep in this. Honestly, sleep in it. Um, then I have my holy grail skirt. Oh, I love this baby. This I got from H&M. Um, oh, the cardigan was a medium from Urban Outfitters, if I didn't already say that. And then this is an extra small. Damn, I was an extra small. It's a little short on me now, but I'll still wear it. I wear this with knee highs, tights, nothing. So cute. I wear this with um, my crop American Apparel sweater. Ooh. I just, oh my gosh, I love this skirt. It looks so cute. And you can literally wear it with absolutely anything. Then, oh, uh, my holy grail shoes of all time. I don't think I'll ever get rid of these. Best investment I've ever made. They were the first like high heel shoes I ever really bought and I was like, okay, I'll wear them. Like I've been looking for Jeffrey Campbell's like these all the time and you know, they're a thicker heel so I won't fall and I think I wear these babies every damn day. Oh my god, aren't they so cute guys? Guess where I got them? H&M. What? I know. Um, I'm size 8 in these bibbas, and these were like $30, I think, and they've held up so well. I wear these with everything. I wore them today to school. Holla holla. But, moving on. So my holy grail bag of all time is this thing, this satchel from Target. Do I need to go in detail? It's ugly, but I literally, my life is in this bag. My life. Yeah, my life. Okay, um, so makeup wise, I picked out a few things that are really, really like I'll probably never like stop using. And my foundation is like this. Oh my god, Lancome foundation. This stuff makes you look beautiful. And ever since I discovered it, I will never go back to anything else. I love this so much. And then for setting powder. I've also been using this for years. You can't really see it because I put my foundation on it and then apply it on. But it's the Neutrogena Skin Clearing Mineral Powder and it's matte. So like it gets, ugh, I was sweating so I'm a little shiny. But it gets rid of some of the shine and I think it just gives your face a really nice finish. And um, lipstick, oh my god. MAC Faux Lipstick, seriously, beautiful. I wear this way too often as you can tell. And, oh my god, this is my favorite MAC lipstick ever. Of all time, holy grail, mascara, you guys. It's CoverGirl Lash Blast Fusion because I've tried designer mascaras and they just don't work for me. They literally come down to my face. And this is the only one that stays on and looks hella bomb and makes my lashes look hella bomb and makes them look hella long and hella voluminous and hella thick and hella curled and go cover girl. Holy Grail lip gloss is oh okay so it's Max Angel lip gloss and I'm almost out but it's just like a light sparkly pink super pretty love it love it love it definitely recommend this it's the prettiest pink shade you will ever purchase I promise my Moroccan oil curl defining cream and it really like oh this stuff is the shit I put it on my hair like when it's wet and it keeps my hair intact or somewhat curly as you can see Ow. oh my god this bracelet just ripped out my hair ah! thanks andy anyway it keeps these curls not too crazy so i love this i've been using this forever as well that was all peace out guys see you later comment what you want Goodbye.